Tina Turner was born Anna Mae Bullock on November 26, 1939 in Brownsville, Tennessee, the youngest daughter of Floyd Richard Bullock and his wife Zelma Priscilla. As a young girl, Turner sang in the church choir at Nutbush's Spring Hill Baptist Church. When she was 11, her mother Zelma ran off without warning, seeking freedom from her abusive relationship with Floyd by relocating to St. Louis in 1950. As a teenager, Tina worked as a domestic worker for the Henderson family. She was at the Henderson house when she was notified that her half-sister Evelyn had died in a car crash alongside her cousins Margaret and Vila Evans. A self-professed tomboy, Bullock joined both the cheerleading squad and the female basketball team at Carver High School in Brownsville and socialized every chance she got. When Bullock was 16, her grandmother died, so she went to live with her mother in St. Louis. She graduated from Sumner High School in 1958. After high school, Bullock worked as a nurse's aide at Barnes Jewish Hospital. Tina and her sister began to frequent nightclubs in St. Louis and East St. Louis. She first saw Ike Turner perform with his band The Kings of Rhythm at the Manhattan Club in East St. Louis. Bullock was impressed by his talent, recalling that she almost went into a trance watching him play. She asked Turner to let her sing in his band despite the fact that few women had ever sung with him. Ike said he'd call her but never did. One night in 1957, she got hold of the microphone from Kings of Rhythm drummer Eugene Washington during an intermission and she sang the B.B. King blues ballad, You Know I Love You. Upon hearing her sing, Ike asked her if she knew more songs. She sang the rest of the night and became a featured vocalist with his band. In the fall of 1969, Ike and Tina Turner's profile in their home country was raised after opening for the Rolling Stones on their U.S. tour, they gained more exposure from performances on The Ed Sullivan Show, Playboy After Dark, and The Andy Williams Show in 1974, the duo released the Grammy-nominated album The Gospel according to Ike and Tina, which was nominated for Best Soul Gospel Performance. By the mid-1970s, Ike was heavily addicted to cocaine, which hindered his relationship with Turner. She filed for divorce on July 27, and it was finalized on March 29, 1978. After his death on December 12, 2007, Turner issued a brief statement through her spokesperson. Tina hasn't had any contact with Ike in more than 30 years. No further comment will be made. In 1986, Turner met German music executive Erwin Bach, who was sent by her European record label, Emmy, to greet Turner at Dusseldorf Airport. Bach was over 16 years her junior. Initially friends, they began dating later that year. In July 2013, after a 27-year romantic relationship, they married in a civil ceremony on the banks of Lake Zurich in Kusnacht, Switzerland. Turner had two biological sons, one with Kings of Rhythm saxophonist Raymond Hill, named Raymond Craig, born on August 20, 1958, and the other with Ike Turner, Ronald Ronnie, Rennell Turner, born on October 27, 1960. She also adopted two of Ike Turner's children, raising them as her own. Ike Turner adopted Raymond Craig Hill and changed his name to Craig Raymond Turner. Craig was found dead in an apparent suicide in July 2018. Turner revealed in her 2018 memoir My Love Story that she had multiple life-threatening illnesses. She had high blood pressure since 1978, which remained mostly untreated, and resulted in damage to her kidneys and eventual kidney failure. In 2013, three weeks after her wedding to Erwin Bach, she had a stroke and needed to learn to walk again. In 2016, she was diagnosed with intestinal cancer. While she attempted to treat her health problems with homeopathy, they worsened. Her chances of receiving a kidney transplant were considered low, and she was urged to start dialysis. She signed up with an organization that facilitates assisted suicide, a procedure which is legal in Switzerland, becoming a member of Exit International. However, her husband Bach offered to donate a kidney for transplant. Turner accepted his donation and had kidney transplant surgery on April 7, 2017. On May 24, 2023, Turner died at her home in Kusnacht, Switzerland, aged 83, after years of illnesses.